So here's our second trial run of the replumbed hydraulic heating system. So we have an 83% efficient boiler that's about 10 years old, uh, perfectly good condition, and I've replumbed it uh, uh, using the instrument quarter uh, iron pipe up to a brass valve, and then connected to the new uh, copper instrument quarter swept pipe that I put in. So this is the return line. Over here you see the supply line uh, with the uh, riser pipe to the air valve and the uh, water inlet, which I've replumbed into our uh, new cut system. It's uh, the appropriate distance away from the, from the chimney. And over here is the circulating pump, which right now I have hot wired because I've been circulating it uh, to uh, clean out the system. And of course the uh, brass, uh, Inner connection to the copper and the iron and shot off valve, and then we have the instrument quarter pipe, which I sweat. All this is what I put in hangers, uh, pipe insulation, and this now travels over to the um, manifold, a uh, 12 quart manifold. This is a Zern manifold by, made by an Italian company. We have the uh, shut off valve, drain valve, and air admit air, air valve temperature and then we have all the individual ports and um, we have all the connections going out here using three quarter inch uh, Upanor, uh oxygen free pipe and then down here is the returns and um, of course the shut off valves which can also be replaced with solenoids if I choose to do some automation uh, later on and then of course the temperature of the return. I have a uh, inline filter to try and prevent uh, chunks of uh, uh, iron and rust uh, going back into the boiler. And then this is a return line. Again, each of quarter sweated copper, insulated, and um, going back into the boiler.